Hi, my name is Laura Herrera. I will be doing my persuasive speech. Okay. Have your, have your parents ever told you why you shouldn't waste your food? Or have you ever gotten food where you didn't finish it all? And right when you were about to toss it away, or you told your mom that you didn't want to eat it, and she's always said, well, why would you get extra if you know that you weren't going to finish it? You know, there's kids out there that don't, that wish they had a bite of that. Well, I'm going to talk to you about food waste. Um, many times we waste food without realizing the side effects. Um, in the world, there's many people that don't have food to eat. Um, wasting food can cause environmental concerns and it also wastes money, of course. Um, we're going to be talking more about um, people that don't have much food to eat. Um, just a fun fact out there, just the food wasted in Europe would feed 200 million starving people. That's a lot of people. Um, there's some environmental concerns. Some would be that it ends up in landfills and produces methane. Methane causes infrared radiation and heats up the Earth's atmosphere, which causes global warming and climate change. So not only are you polluting, but you're also causing global warming. That's a big issue. Um, and of course, wasting money. 40% um, of food is not eaten. 40%. So like 60% we do eat, which is not even, that's, that's a little bit, honestly. Um, can you imagine how it is on Thanksgiving? Um, according to Harvard studies, 165 billion ends up in landfill each year. I'm sorry, 165 billion dollars. That's a lot. That's crazy. Um, what we could do, um, we can to stop. Wasting food would be to shop smarter, um, save and actually eat leftovers, um, and you can help by donating untouched food that you know you won't eat. Um, it could help those who might not have a steady food supply. Um, I know that there's some... The, a lot of places tend to donate like churches and stuff for those people that do um, need food assistance. Um, I would definitely try looking into that to help save food waste. Um, it um, also and so all in all, what I would recommend from not to not waste food, I would say. It's, um, it definitely saves money from buying less food um, if you shop smarter, of course. Um, it supports your community resources, of course, like I said, churches and stuff, always good to donate. Um, and it prevents pollution and reduces methane emissions. So, you know, save the turtles, save the planet. Um, less global warming. Polar bears are important, too. Um... So those are the reasons why our parents have always told us not to waste our food. Um, many people don't have food to eat. There's environmental concerns and it's obviously a waste of money. Um, remember that there's kids out there that wish they had that piece of crust you decided to throw away. Um, so yeah, definitely don't waste your food, kids. Uh, make sure you eat everything. If not, you know, try to share. Or even if you go to, I would say like, like for example, like me and my boyfriend, when we go and get food, we tend to share it in half. So I he so we get like um like a big plus it saves you money. So if you get like a whole meal and say you know you're not gonna finish it, it's you're paying half probably less than half than what would you spend on one um and then you both eat it and then you 
guys are satisfied and you won't have the need to waste. Okay, um, so that's it. Um, again, my name is Laura Hare and this is my persuasive speech on food waste.